Hello and welcome back to Square Talk, the show where we talk about all things square with me, Michael Square. Brought to you by Lions Tea, puts the talk into tea. Last week we spoke about vintage crockery with teapot enthusiast Antique, and this week we're speaking to juggler Stephen McGinley. So juggling, why? Uh, it's just an amazingly uh, rewarding pastime and skill to learn. I'm always getting better. Every time I practice I get better and better at juggling and I just love it. How did it come into your life? I mean, when I was 10, I messed around with tennis balls and I learned the basics. And then when I was about 25, uh, my brother Joe went and bought a unicycle. Yeah. And so I got into the unicycle, I joined a juggling club and I just fell in love with juggling. Do you think anyone can juggle? I think anyone can learn to juggle, yes. Okay. I mean, you need to have patience and you need mm -hmm. to be willing to put in time and effort. I'm left-handed, does that pose any issues? Uh, as a left-hander, I think left-handers have a slight advantage. Okay. Because you guys are more used to using your alternate hand. Okay. Because obviously you live in a right-handed world. Yes. So I, do, I have found that left-handers have a slight advantage. Life can be pretty tough, but so can juggling. So now we move on to a game we call The Juggle Is Real. So Stephen, you're going to start juggling and I'm going to make things progressively more difficult for you. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's okay, do this. Let's go. Here we go. That's good. You're used to that. I can do that. And then life throws you a curveball. Number four. I got that. And sometimes when you get used to your curveball, life throws you a tea bag. And a second tea bag because you're stressed. And, and a third tea bag because you need the caffeine. What's something we might not know about juggling? I suppose one interesting thing about juggling is that there's a mathematical notation behind it. Mm -hmm. So it's not unlike music notation, uh, a lot of juggling tricks can be described with mathematics. Mm -hmm. And a lot of jugglers would work as engineers or mathematicians or computer programmers. There's a, yeah. a huge crossover there. What's the heaviest thing you've ever juggled? The heaviest thing? I, I did train with wrist weights for a while when I started mm. out to really try and hone my technique. Okay. Well, I'm going to stop you there, Stephen, because we do need to talk tea. Lion's tea is now square. New shape. <sighs> Same great taste. What's the strangest thing you've been booked to do? I suppose one of my favourites is to juggle on the radio. Okay. And I've juggled live on the radio several times. How does that sound? I've heard it's come across very well. But uh, you'd have to wonder. And you're from Galway? From Galway City, yes. yeah. Yes, yeah. Does everyone juggle in Galway? Uh, there's a bit of that, yeah. I think mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's certainly, uh, it must be in the water there. Right, so Michael, we're going to do a little juggling lesson. Yeah. And I want all your concentration to be on throws. So it's like this. One, two. Wow. Nice one. You're, you're very good yeah, at this. Thank you. Do you feel like trying the third ball? Uh, yeah. So I'm just okay. going to demonstrate first. You have to remember to start with the hand that's holding the two. Okay. That'll probably be your left hand. Uh -huh. And you're going to do one, two, three, stop. Nice. Uh, have you ever tried clowning? Uh, I've done a little clowning. Yeah. Clowning workshops have been the most valuable thing I've ever done in my life. It's the, also the scariest thing I've ever done. Mm -hmm. By far the most terrifying experience I've ever had yeah. in my whole life. Because you're surrounded a, by clowns. A so clowning yeah. workshop, yeah. yeah. yeah it's very, very sc scary, but really valuable mm -hmm. uh, and an incredible art. Can I ask you where you get your shirts? Because, like, as you've noticed, I'm quite a snappy dresser myself. It's a, I so do I, like the style, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. I, Especially I think, the tie and the, yeah. Yeah. And I, I wonder. I'm I enjoy colour. Yes, so well, I like to use lots of colours on. I did want to make a little effort, you know, coming on here. Yes, and, uh, and we thank you for that. Oh, Stephen, thank you so much for coming in and talking juggling with me. It was lovely to meet you. You too, thank you so much. Nothing better than sitting down, having some tea and having a chat about juggling. Absolutely. Well, that's been Square Talk, the talk show in which we talk about all things square. I've been your host, Michael Square. My guest was Stephen McGinley, and you have been my audience. And this has been my outro. <laughs>